Hey Mark, uh, we're back in the second little video for your mini series, I guess. Uh, we're back with your TCS Slim Star Killer. This thing is really cool. Uh, you messaged me about this a while back with a couple of other sabers that you mentioned getting installs, and you wanted this one to be the first just to kind of test the waters with me, which I do really appreciate. Um, I hope that this matches up with your standards. Um, I typically keep myself at a pretty high caliber, so hopefully I can get to uh, see more work from you in the future, because this thing is really cool. You've got another couple of cool sabers that you have wanting to get installed, and I would love to do something with them. Um, originally, we wanted to go pretty basic on this, but you decided that uh, after talking and kind of hemming and hawing about it, we decided to go for a pixel strip and some other extra little bits in the chassis. Um, just kind of going over it, I did give this whole hill a little IPA wash um, after I got everything gutted out, um, just to kind of clean up some of the grime and dirt laying and stuff like that, and just kind of get it back to a nice clean finish. Um, as far as the install goes, this was originally installed with NBV4 and a, I think it was a Tricree, might have been a Luxian or something like that. Um, and a wired in battery with a recharge port, uh, and a, I think it was a Vico 28 millimeter speaker. Uh, inoperable, it was broken, um, but we brought this thing into the modern world a little bit. We've got a CC Sabres V3 in the emitter, a Shadowfoil Props 9 pixel PCB for the crystal. You've got a 15 pixel accent strip under the Profi board removable 18650 and kill switch, and a Smuggler's Outpost 28 millimeter speaker. Let's crack this thing open and kind of go over everything in here. You had a couple of fonts that you wanted me to throw on. I also got that done for you along with the uh, entire config. Um, so we'll just kind of go over it real quick. Here's your kill switch, battery, 28 mil speaker, profi board, and your 15 pixel accent strip is going to sit right in here um, I did have one, uh, probably about half of a pixel poking up under the Profi, um, just to kind of give it a little bit of shine through the through the gaps in the wiring pathways and stuff like that. Um, and I did also go in here and do some gasket maker to kind of close off the back of the speaker a little bit, um, give it a little bit more of a fuller sound. Uh, kill switch, up is off, down is on. <laughs> Crystal lights up just nice. Accent pixel is doing the same. Wait, Obi Wan Kenobi. Just to showcase your fonts. And just to show you that the kill switch does work, your bottom button here is going to be your activation. And to show you the pixels do work. And again, for your kill switch, flip it up, cuts everything out. Throw that back on. Throw the grip back on. I did go in and clean up your threads a little bit, and I did re-grease them so it's nice and buttery smooth. You did have me make you a 7 8 inch blade for this. Uh, this thing is a freaking monster. Uh, typically, I do either 32 or 34 inch blades for my use. Um, you wanted a 40 incher, and it's huge. It is a monster blade. Um, So just to show you that the blade also works.
yeah, like I said, this thing is really cool. I uh, think that I'm going to start looking for one of these for myself. Um, I really like this. But your blade is done. Your hilt is done. I am actually going to throw in a blade plug for this. I've got a couple sitting around. It's just a, a 3D printed razor style plug. Um, just to kind of soak up some of the extra blade material I had to uh, remove to fit everything. Um, but you do have you do have swing on, you do have twist off. I will be messaging you to make sure that you want to keep those, or if you want to get rid of them, no big deal to me. A copy of the config file is going to be on your SD card, um, just in case you need to do anything with it, and everything is labeled in the config um, for your main blade, crystal chamber, and accent strip. That way there's no questions on what you're editing. Um, but as far as everything else goes, I mean, that's really it, man. Uh, like I said, your rear button is activation. Upper button is auxiliary. This thing's loud, man. This thing's really cool. But anyways, that is your TCS SK, Slim SK. Um... I will be messaging you here in a second to figure out shipping because that blade is going to be kind of a nightmare a little bit, but no big deal. You know, you and I have already kind of talked briefly briefly about it, um, but I will ship this out to you as soon as possible. Um, obviously not today. Today is Sunday, um, and as long as I get out of work at a reasonable time tomorrow, I should be able to hop that out to you, no problem. Thanks, man. May the force be with you. Hopefully I get to work with you again. I appreciate your business, and I appreciate you giving me the opportunity. See ya.